what up y'all I thank you guys once again for tuning in to Wise Your Minds Media It's your boy Deuce Today I got another stizzy pod This one here is do si uh, As you guys know I've been uh, doing the stizzy reviews lately I've just been trying to try, you know, try out the pods Been smoking a lot of the CO2 cartridges And I just wanted to, you know, experiment a little bit but man, this do si do uh, pod was the strongest one that they had at the club that I go to. And honestly, I'm like, uh, you know, my tolerance, I, I got a tolerance. So I'm thinking like, oh, this ain't going, you know, it ain't going to be nothing. Like, it, it's weak. Which, don't get me wrong, it's not like a big knock you out or nothing like that. But yeah, it definitely, pla- blah, blah, blah. It definitely packs a punch. And um, it, 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 it's some quality oil, man. I've smoked this down to about, what, quarter? Not halfway yet. About a quarter uh, ways. Ah, one thing before I get into this video. When I went to the club, they did have like a little uh a little event that Stizzy was doing. And um if you buy a Stizzy cartridge, they were giving away this bag. It was an empty bag. It didn't have like, you know, everything that I have. And then I just keep like my knickknacks, bongs, papers, uh everything in there, man. All that good stuff. Yeah. Giving out these cool lanyards. As you guys know, I mess with the lanyards. Also got a um, Bloom Farms when they sent me. But um, not only that, they gave me a pin battery, an extra pin battery. And I do have the um, black pin battery. It was hard for me to get a hold to, so I had to order it from their website, the club that I that I usually go to and that I went to this time um, to buy this particular cartridge. They were always out of the black battery, um, and they just so happened to be giving them away for free if you bought a cartridge. So I also got another battery. Man, I'm going to go ahead and get into this review. Um, if you have anything to, uh, you know, spark up a pin, bowls, blunts, uh, bongs, whatever it may be, man, go ahead and light it up if you're 18 and older. And uh, yeah, man, cheers. Almost dropped it. I'm going to try not to get it as cloudy as um, these last past two videos. <coughs> I want to be able to see y'all, man. As you can see, I'm already coughing. <coughs> and I haven't, you know, um, hit this since, like, this morning. By the way, I hope you guys are having a great day out there. Hope you guys are putting that positive energy out into the world, man. And I just want everybody to be happy, feeling good. You feel me? I'm happy right now. I appreciate you guys for continuing to subscribe. If you are watching this video and you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe. Subscribe. Be sure to subscribe, man. If you are watching this video and you're subscribed, and you know someone that might have a YouTube channel or a Gmail account uh, and they haven't subscribed or don't know about Wiser Minds Media, tell them to subscribe. Follow me on social media at Deuce Different. That will always be in the description and I'm starting to put them in the videos too. I love um, the taste of this pen. Um, a lot of people tell me, even some people at the club are like, these cartridges are a little too sweet. And like I said, the Straw Nana was a little too sweet for me. The do si do, not too sweet for me. I mean, it's it's perfect. I mean, I taste the herbal taste that I, you guys know I like. The taste, I would rate it a 10. If I was to rate the high, definitely going to be a 10. Man, hit me instantly when I first got this pen. I'm like, okay. I mean, it crept up on me. Did see that they had some things going on a while ago with their testing. And uh, I guess te it wasn't pesticides, but they tested for like bins. I don't, I don't know what it, what it is. It's like one of those chemicals that, you know, we can technically ingest, but it's not too good for us. A lot or a certain amount of it isn't good for us. If you're buying from a licensed dispensary, then they're selling the real deal. If you're not buying from the licensed dis uh, licensed dispensary, then you might not be getting the real deal, man. I've been seeing a lot of those reviews online, and uh, that's not good. If it's not 
child proofed and it doesn't have like the it's like I wish I had mine still it's like a little uh a black case that you have to kind of squeeze your thumbs like to kind of slide it open if it doesn't have that man and it's like in the little styrofoam packs because I have got a, a stizzy in the styrofoam pack I believe that was the um, it was a San Fernando Valley OG uh, that I had got and it was another one too but it wasn't the one that um I did a video on um it was after I had did these past two videos be sure that you're looking at the testing results you you don't want to ingest or or harm your body you don't want to put anything bad into your body man and yeah I just thought I'd let you guys know that because I've been paying attention to that lately and you know I don't want to leave those who don't know too much um, about cannabis or like the oil the things that they're putting in a lot of people don't know how the stuff is made and uh yeah man any way that I can inform you guys you know I will man. I know I said if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed be sure to subscribe um not even just subscribe if you guys are watching this be sure to hit the thumbs up click that like button um you know I just want the likes to equal up to the people you know watching watching the video if you're watching this be sure to like it man it don't hurt just hit that thumbs up even if you want to hit the thumbs down you feel me and you you want to be a uh, sour sour puss you could go ahead and do that too but uh you feel me we still gonna prevail over here. <laughs> but yeah, man, um do -si do definitely um definitely the pod that I would recommend. Um if you know any dispensaries or have any dispensaries in your area that you are really comfortable going to, um and they don't have any stizzies, try to recommend them getting stizzies. Maybe like I know that's what my club tells me. Um, are the clubs that I go to and don't have what I'm looking for so you know the more you talk their ear off and bug them they're gonna end up ordering it you know <laughs> but anyway man uh yeah stizzy do -si do this pod is gonna be a 10 out of 10 from your boy let me know what you guys would like to see in these upcoming videos um I know I said I was gonna do the PAX era um, review and I am gonna do the PAX era review I've been thinking like, dang, man, I'm just going crazy with the stizzies, bro, and I ain't even, you feel me, uh, indulging in the uh, Pax Era Pods no more, but I actually love that pen. Um, I only used it once, um, or bought, I believe, one or two cartridges for it, then I just stopped using it, but I am going to be doing a Pax Era Pod um, review. I know you guys will like that. Um, you know, you could hook that pen up to your phone and do all that crazy stuff. It is your boy Deuce, man. Um, I appreciate you guys for tuning in to Wiser Minds Media. Um, this was a review on the Stizzy Dosey Doe Pods. Man, that sounded Dosey Doe, you know, so. Alright, let's go. Um, but yeah, man, Thank you for tuning in. Um, like, uh, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. If um, you have subscribed, be sure to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe. And then um, try to subscribe again on another account. And then subscribe again on another account. And keep making accounts and subscribe. And then so on and so on and so on. Yeah, man. We're going to keep the reviews coming. Yeah, man. Thank you for rocking with your boy. Peace. I'm out.